You have been diagnosed with arthritis. Not sure about the cause of treatment? Dr. Ashok Goel, a senior orthopedic surgeon, tells us what sort of drugs are used for the treatment of arthritis. The rheumatoid arthritis treatment is now managed mostly with drugs. The drugs that were available were disease modifying drugs called as DMRD, which included steroid, methotrexate, and uh, chloroquine analogs and sulfasalazine. However, the latest addition to the drug is anti tumor necrotic factor alpha. Basically, this causes the immune response to sub be suppressed causes the inflammation around the joint to be reduced though we are aware that the drugs are more toxic and they have to be managed very closely by the rheumatologists in which we take care of the blood parameters and also the liver and the kidney functions. The rheumatoid management is brought up in steps. So we have got during the acute phase, we give the patients steroids we give them methotrexate and we can add another drug in the form of sulfasalazine or a chlorine analog. This is a multi-drug modality so that each drug has its own functions and the idea is to reduce the inflammation, prevent occurrence of deformity and joint contractures and to restore joint functions. The idea of this is so that you take the pain away, maintain the quality of life of the patient prevent osteoporosis around the joint because of the inflammation and restore functions without major deformities. There is a newer addition that is called the anti-tumor necrotic factor alpha drug which is given intravenously has to be managed very closely and that is very effective and in that case uh, the inflammation reduced considerably and also the advantage is that um, it reduces the osteoporosis or osteopenia around the articular cartilages. For more videos related to relieving pain, log on to onlymyhealth.com.